What's good everybody? How you guys doing out there in YouTube land? Sam Fasumanu back again with another GameStop Dumpster Finds video. Um, this is stuff I found from last night. Um, I got some pretty cool stuff. Not a lot, but in terms of quality, it's some really cool stuff. And you'll see in a bit when I show you. Um, I also found, um, along with the one bag that I got a lot of this cool stuff from, I also found a really big... One of those really one of those really big poster boxes. I found one of those stuffed with you know a bunch of posters, um, game display boxes. I have that downstairs um, in the uh, basement, the dungeon, because I plan on making a separate video for that. Because making a video for like posters and stuff like that, that's always that's always a pain in the ass to make. So I'm upstairs right now. About to bring you this video, making this video in me and my wife's bedroom because I am going to take a nap after this. <laughs> but um, I already put something in front of you. One piece from, uh, you know, a few of the things that I found already. Trying to start off with the not so interesting things. So, found a Game Informer, the Order 1886. I got a ton of these now downstairs that I found from uh, previous dives, but I just found one in that uh, bag um, last night. Uh, let's see, bunch of artwork, game insert art, nothing that you haven't already seen. You know, there's a Xbox 360 Army of Two, a bunch of those, um, Metal Gear. Solid, one of my favorite games of all times, or of all time, blah blah blah. God of War. So there's yeah, a mix of um of games. Insert art. Let's throw this back here. Let's see what else? What else? Some Nintendo DS cases. These are the titles. They all have manuals. However, I did not find any um, Nintendo Club points, unfortunately. I found a couple more of these Xbox One little booklets. Showcasing the game, accessories, and games for the system. See, I found a Watch Dogs lanyard, surprisingly in great shape. The only thing missing, obviously, is the uh, lanyard plastic card piece, or whatever you want to call it. Other than that, everything is in great shape. This is a game that I'm looking forward to um, buying when it comes out for my PS4. So, Watch Dogs lanyard. Um, I found this, I believe it's for the PlayStation, uh, Tosa brand, oh, excuse me, but it is a, yeah, there you go, charge on off, some kind of charging station, maybe for controllers, or another accessory, but, you know, pretty cool, nothing wrong with it, not broken or anything like that. Um, let's see, I found a few games, but you know, I'll just get this empty case out of the way and I'll save the games for last. Found this empty Xbox 360 game of the year, Batman Arkham City. Um, manual and case, one of those with this middle portion in there. Found that. Let's see. Found this little God of War Ghost of Sparta. This is not for resale. Um, it's a UMD. You can see back there if it'll focus. There, like a UMD slip sleeve cover case thing for the game. I thought it was cool. I looked all through the bag before I threw it away to see if. I might score and get lucky and find the actual UMD, but 
No luck, but this is cool, you know. Found a enslaved Odyssey to the West. A little comic book, Namco, Marvel. Uh, interesting to find this in the uh, GameStop bag. I found another one of these Witcher 2 Assassins of Kings Enhanced Edition Quest Handbook. I just recently found this like a night ago. This one's in great shape also. And I also found another, because I have a few of these already, the slip sleeve cover for the game Xbox 360. And then this uh, Xbox 3 month Xbox Live Gold membership. The um, code is already scratched off. It's more than likely used. But if you want to go ahead and try it for yourself, if it'll focus, there it is. Probably doesn't work, but hey, you could try it out if you want to. Um, let's see. Found another one of these cards. GameStop gift card with Mario. Uh, one, now let's get into like the really cool stuff. I found this box, Nintendo 3DS. For this game, Shin Megami Tensei. Shin Megami Tensei. Pretty cool freaking box, and there's stuff in there. Let me get that out. So, like a few of the other interesting boxed game things that I found in the past were, um, put it up on the pillow like this, where I would find the box, like a, like a booklet, art book, and a music CD same thing with this I mean I've never heard of this game before um, this is the uh, music collection it says right there it's still sealed it has a little pretty thick sort of strategy and design book yeah and then the case right here I think there's like a piece that flips over or down yeah like that but I like this. I'm keeping this, adding this to my collection. Go ahead and try to put this back in there. So, really happy to come across this. And there's nothing wrong with it. There's no water damage, not ripped, stained, or torn. Again, Shin Megami Tensei. Tensei. I have no idea if I'm saying that right. But, I thought that was cool. And then right here is some more cool stuff. I found not one, but two of these uh, Years of War steel, there you go, steel book, steel case thingies. And what's even more cool is, check this out. I'll open it for you. It has the... Uh, a book, I would say Destroyed Beauty, an inside look at Gears of War. So it has the book. It has, check this out. It has the uh, limited collector's edition bonus disc. Uh, the game, I believe, went there and that's gone. It's for the Xbox 360. This is in freaking spectacular shape. Hey, my fan. I mean... <laughs> I'm happy that they didn't try to trash this or take both discs, you know, or leave it completely empty. And then, of course, the manual right here. And what's what's even or what's even more cool is both of them have, you know, everything. Uh, this one has everything I just showed you in that one as well. Let me open it for you. Let's see. Here's the book again. The manual right here, and then uh, the uh, bonus collector's edition bonus disc. And same with the other one. Practically brand new. So I'm keeping one of these. I only need one. If someone's interested um, in one in the other one, because there's only going to be one left. 
let me know we could work out a deal trade or could buy it uh, but yeah found two of these sorry about the crappy lighting guys Gears of War steel case book case things whatever you want to call them okay got that now on to some cool freaking games that I think you'll like you'll either like the games or you'll just hate me for finding them <laughs> but one in particular and I'll show you that that'll be like the last one but uh, this one's not that great but it's a game still in there it's we my word coach uh, complete game case manual again spotless hey everybody that I almost threw this in the trash because I mean I, I go through these cases and I check them and for some reason I almost didn't check this one but I did this is one of those generic cases but it's Assassin's Creed for the PS3 and guess what no manual but Assassin's Creed PlayStation 3 greatest hits and then check this out practically brand new I mean, wow. So we got that. Now the last game, I'm really happy I found it. Um, I don't have the system for it. Well, I have the system, but it's uh, in my uh, kiosk. <laughs> it's, it's for an Xbox 360. I have an Xbox 360 I found dumpster diving a while ago. And it works, but not, you know, you can't play games. It has that red ring of death, but I have everything to go with it. Um can't think of the word but anyways uh, the game I'm going to show you is for that system but even though I don't have a working Xbox 360 I, I, I plan on keeping this just because of what it is and you'll see in just a second actually you'll see right now check this out Xbox 360 Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Let's see it's pre-owned holy crap come on Yeah, focus is crappy. But uh, when I got this, I'm like, oh, cool, another one. Because I found a case and a manual like this a while back. But then when I opened it, ta-da! Manual and game complete. And really freaking awesome shape. A small, itty-bitty little scratches. But look at that overall this will play. I'm pretty sure this will play in, in an Xbox 360. I'm really happy to find this. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles for the Xbox 360. Oh, there you go. $39.99 for pro members. $35.99. I can't believe they threw this away. I'm happy they did. Thank you, uh, Lame Stop, for throwing stuff like this away. But like I said, um, I don't have a working Xbox 360, but because... It's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle related, and I love the Ninja Turtles. I plan on keeping this. So that's it, guys. My uh, finds. So basically, out of everything, those are the things that I plan on keeping. Um, maybe even the uh, Assassin's Creed, because, I, I mean, I have a PS4 now, but, you know, to add to my PS3 collection, I might play pop it in my PS3. But everything else is up for grabs. You know, the other one of Gears of War thingy. And the other games. And the uh, charging dock station. The lanyard, whatever. So let me know what you think. Thank you for watching. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you very much to all my subscribers. Those who like, comment. Um, the YouTube inbox thing is really annoying. I'm trying to respond to everyone's comments over my phone. I uh, should probably just go on my computer, but the inbox thing is a pain in the ass. But um, thank you guys very much. I really appreciate you guys. Uh, stay tuned for more cool videos. And as always, take it easy. I'm going to take a nap, and I will see you in the next video.